Inserting a text box into Microsoft Excel is a little different than inserting a comment. So if we insert a comment, it just does it within the cell itself. But if we insert a text box, we can move it around and it can be as large as we want as well. So we need to be under the Insert tab at the very top. And then off to the right, we see text box. Now, you don't see anything right away, but what it does is it changes the cursor. So you can see the cursor looks different than it did before. Now, if I left click and drag it over an area and let go, now we see our text box. And I'll just type in, this is the sales report for the awesome company. And I'll click away. And we can see the box is no longer editable at this point, although we can get right back in and edit it once again. Another thing we can do is we can move this around. So if I click again, once uh, I'm back in it, I'll move my cursor up to the top until it turns into this cross. And now I can move it. Let's say it might be a little bit too big and blocking things. That's OK. In the bottom, I can you move my cursor until it turns into a double arrow and I can move up like that and now it makes more sense. Now let's say, oh, maybe it's too wide. Well, I can do that too. There we go. Now, once I have that the way I want it, I can also use these boxes that you see over here. So right now it's off to the left. I could center it, move it to the right. I could also move it to the top or the bottom of the box as well. I can also go in and change the size of the font as well as the color. There we go. Now it's blue. And if I want, I can even drop in a highlight into the background. That might be a little bit dark, so we'll use that color there. So there's a lot of different things that you can do with the text box. They're very useful, and you can insert as many in as many different colors and sizes as you need.